So here we go again. We're, we're testing things as usual. Here at the uh, OK Mountain, the Mountain Smith Laboratory and Workshop. And what I have here is a piece of AUPT plastic made with AUPT dust and um, Elmer's glue. And, and there's some some silk here on the side just because I uh, had it attached to a piece of silk. So there may be some silk inside there, I don't know. Um, but what we're doing right now is, see, I've been working on showing people hardness tests, yeah? And, and diamonds, and, you know, diamonds are 10 on the Mohs scale of hardness. This is a piece of calcite, um, and calcite is four and a half on the Mohs scale of hardness, and, and when you move it around, this one's got a rainbow in it, it's pretty cool. It's called rainbow calcite. And that's because the spacing in those planes of cleavage are half the size of a wavelength of visible light. And, and I made a scratch on this earlier, so let's find a nice clear place and see if I can... Yeah, that, that was my scratch right near the top there. Let's see what I can do here. Whoops, Jitski. Can't see through the other stone. All right, here we go. Might be. Don't know. Let me put the phone down. Right. <laughs> Ooh, we got it on 10. Alright, there we go. There's the scratches. So, I don't know if I actually scratched it. <laughs> I did, man. Look at that. My AUPT plastic is at this point in time, four and a half on the Mohs scale of hardness. Four and a half. The, uh, the official Mohs scale of hardness test kit I have comes with a, um, the, the, um, Number two, number one is uh, talc, and, and I don't think I, I actually have a number one tester, um, but um, our fingernails, two is what plastic, most plastic is, that's what this is, okay? plastic is soft, you all know what plastic is, and it doesn't last long, right, if you... If I made a, an airplane out of this, I, just a minute, please. Okay, so we're cooking breakfast here, asking questions. And she's also, <laughs> she took a, a rather uh, more larger piece of AUPT plastic that I made yesterday. And what I'm doing differently this time, uh, with this stuff, and uh, geez, man, I, mm, that is so frustrating. <laughs> I hate it when my camera can't focus. Okay, so this is um, made with AUPT dust, and you can see that in there, and Elmer's glue. But I also added a little bit of pickling lime. Lime, 
like they used to mark football fields with, right? But that's also what you use to make pickles with. And, and we'd buy Mrs. Wages pickling lime from Amazon and from the food section. Okay, so, so this is, a, you know, made with food grade material, which means I can, I can eat off of it and I can, um, I can um, feed my children off of it. And it doesn't off gas, it doesn't give them poisonous stuff. Plastic made from petroleum does. It, it, it's not good stuff at all. So, um, I can make clear plastic. Look at that. Clear, very sparkly plastic. Because that's definitely not a like a crystal of something in there. And I, first of all, I screened everything down to... Uh, uh, 300 microns, so everything in there uh, that you see that are kind of large chunks, they, they, they assembled themselves from 300 micron dust and created little crystals as it started to, uh, to harden. And that's why my plastic is so very, very hard. Um, the normal plastic is, um, God damn it, two, softer than our fingernail, right? We can, fingernails are two and a half on the Mohs scale of hardness. Um, and some plastic you can scratch with your fingers, uh, you know, fingernails, some not. So it's two, two and a half. Right in there, um, and uh, you know, I keep little valve things and diamonds together just in case, and and that you know, other stuff. Um, anyway, this just dried naturally. I I just let it dry um, inside that little jar there. Um, and it's been there, you know, about a week, I guess. Um, so four and a half on the most scale of hardness. Now, what I've told people is that when I'm done with this stuff, it will be five and a half on the most scale of hardness, like um, stainless steel. Okay. Like stainless steel. 